Gut wrenches can end a match in literally less than five seconds. It is one of the most important uh, components of freestyle and of course, Greco wrestling. And in this video, we're gonna be practicing them. We're gonna be defending them, telling you guys tips and tricks. Of course, ourselves, we gotta get our workout in. Uh, we're gonna be competing here in less than a month now at the U23s. And gut defense is probably my biggest thing that I need work on because I'm perfect on my feet against anyone. Once it comes to mat wrestling, <laughs> We, we gotta strengthen these bad boys up. So we're gonna head to the high school. We're gonna get with Crosby and we're gonna get some training in. And we made it. We're back at the OG, the East Wrestling Room. Also, we are here and we, we, we got a character on the vlogs that hasn't been in the vlog since. Well, honestly, it feels like years. It feels like decades. And, and, and look how they treat him. Right behind the mat cleaner. N um, like Waldo. Like what, like what have they done to you? Waldo isn't just a throwing dummy. It's family. Ugh. Now, if you guys do not know, Waldo is a throwing dummy. Practice all of our suplexes on it and stuff. And he was our coach during freestyle and Greco season. But also, we got some some sick shoes that we are wearing today for the first time. It is my Colats. Um, I got the one of these from a giveaway. Nike Colat Speeds, uh, as you can see, they're very, very worn out. Um, but they're really small, so I actually had to take off the actual uh, insole. But they're really snug, but honestly, I just wore these because I'm gonna take like a really cool Insta pic. Get a brand name Fanny, got me a check on how I go spend it. Kissing the neck, yeah, she in the belly. Need no flights, cause they don't spend it. Betty on my side, she could down, that's some money, do Feel so high, never land, never wanted to. Two snake eyes, don't watch what I'm about to do. I'ma go slide for a bag with the money blow. Real estate, I bring the cash. Need no brakes, I wanna gas. Burn the clip, I'm right in your ass. Louis V. Price, got a mark, mark. So, we just did uh, gut offense and then gut defense as well, uh, preparing for the big turn. Uh, but now I'm just gonna go over some tips that I think will help you guys a lot and also um, will help me a lot because sometimes I forget but I just need a little refresher on my own. So simple, gut stance. You need to be wide, have a wide base, not hands too far, not too much at the side because then it'd be easy for a trapped arm or whatnot. Um, but the biggest thing here is you look into the way they are gutting. So if, if they're trying to gut me this way, I have to look to the left. And when I look to the left, I'm moving almost my whole body in like a crescent shape, like moon position towards the way they're turning. So vice versa, if they're trying to turn me this way, I have to put my whole body, whole body in this way. Um, and I'll show you my legs back here. They're actually doing something unique. So if I look in to the, if they're turning me to the right, this foot is flipping over. So my opposite um, outside ankle is actually down instead of like, just like this and just turning in by flipping this ankle, I should say this ankle as well. If they're turning the other way, that's crucial. Um, on the gut defense, that's really helped me a lot. And just, you know, that extra amount of like torque in order to not get turned. So, um, like we said before, crescent shape into the way they are gutting and you almost always want to be moving when they're doing this because they're lock you want to be able to roll the lock and by rolling the lock um, you can do this if they have a high gut so the guts like right around here are the lock what you're gonna do is you're gonna put like kind of your butt up and then you're just gonna like grind your chest down and then <laughs> are you recording 
But then just no matter what gut wrench they have, you almost always want to be like just moving because that makes it harder for them to actually gut wrench you. Um, but those are my little quick tips. Um, I know that'll help you guys out a lot. And honestly, it's a lot about getting tough, getting the work in, getting the practice in because, you know, get used to guys like, like late in the match, late in the practice, just trying to gut you as hard as they can. And um, by keeping your ribs warm and um, they're gonna get stronger over time. You're gonna build that muscle in there. Um, so I think that'll help you guys out a lot. And as well, there's an exercise you can do. Uh, I actually learned this one at Ringers, actually, um, if you wanna work on your, kind of like your quad pod position when you're getting turned, is you're gonna go up just like this, how we were doing before, but you're gonna do opposite hand, opposite leg up. And this will strengthen your obliques and of course your whole core, which will get you um, <laughs> a lot less easy to turn when you're on bottom. Well now after watching this video, I'm sure that you guys will now never get turned in a gut wrench. But it was really nice getting back in the East wrestling room and just me and Crosby back at it, just grinding it out in the least sus way. But now I am officially done with school. I passed. Oh brother, this guy stinks! Second year of college. So I'm gonna have so much more time and energy to work on YouTube, to make the best videos for you guys, to help you guys out, and of course to create some entertaining content. So the next video that you guys are gonna see is actually me and Crosby once again. We did more of a freestyle practice, more kind of neutral, but I did want to get more into the lifting and more kind of the fitness side. And now I actually got a key fob to go to the Y that will be open 24 seven. So hopefully when we go work out at like midnight, we can film without having to worry about anyone uh, caring or whatever. <laughs> Cause I'm really bad in public with that. <laughs> That's gonna be the video. Thanks so much for watching. I want to give a shout out to my amazing patrons for supporting all the videos. Once you become a patron, your name will literally be in every single video like it is here. It's the best way to individually support me. And also patrons have the opportunity to view these videos before anyone else does. So that's the video. Please like the video if you enjoyed and also subscribe. We got to pass Flow Wrestling and subscribers. It's about time uh, this, this summer. By the time the summer's ended, if we don't pass Flow Wrestling and subscribers, I will be giving away a pair of shoes. I said it here, all right? We better pass. Wait, that actually, ah, please subscribe. I might still give away a pair of shoes. <laughs>